Eric Hullinger, and I have a PhD in physics, and I'm going to explain a little bit about how you tell the measure of an arc, in particular the, the angle of the arc. So let's say we have a circle, something like this, and let's say that we know what the radius of that circle is. Maybe we'll use the letter R for that radius. And let's say that we have a segment along that circle, and we'll call that segment maybe, maybe L. So, so there's sort of a, a segment of that circle, and we want to know what this angle is. So there's a really simple way to figure that out, it turns out. The angle, let's see, is just that length of arc divided by the radius. So, for example, let's say that the length of the arc was 3 and that the radius was 2. Well, based on this formula, that means that the angle would be 1.5. So, one thing that you have to keep in mind when you use this formula is that the angle is in a unit called radians rather than in degrees. If you want it in degrees, you take that and you multiply it by 180 divided by pi. And pi is about 3.14, so let's write 3.14 there. So if you get out your calculator and you, you figure that out, it comes out to about 86 degrees. So that's all there is to it.